Hey you, and welcome back to my channel. So this amazing trip to Stockholm, Sweden was taken in 2018 pre-COVID. And please tell me that you can tell or I'm gonna cry. Well, we made it to the airport. And we're about to board. On to Sweden we go. We went to Stockholm to visit my best friend who moved there for work. This is Stockholm Starbucks. They're everywhere. The espresso house. Although our hosts had to work during the day, they gave us plenty of suggestions for exploring. All right, on our way to the famous Vasa Museum here in Sweden. Basically, we're on an island, and we're on an island like where all you. the museums are. Saying that we had to cut through this garden to get to the museum, but it's it's a cemetery actually. There's like we we can't read it. Like it's really pretty. These must be like super must and be super, super private. The Vasa Vasa. Straight ahead. This is a restored warship that sunk on its maiden voyage in 1628. Contrary to popular belief, this is actually after the Viking period. I know, I was disappointed too. It would have made it that much cooler. These are actual crew member skeletons found aboard the ship. This museum actually had levels so that you could see every angle of the ship. It was so cool. Excellent layout. This place is pretty dope and it was only 10 bucks to get in. I highly recommend the Boston Museum. <laughs> Let's do it, the whole experience. <laughs> Gamastan is Stockholm's oldest town and the most picturesque. Gamastan's main square. It even has the Nobel Prize Museum. And because it's so old, there are a lot of surprises. Look at this tiny door. What is this? It's downstairs, babe. You go first. Me? <laughs> I'm just kidding, I'll go first. Oh my god. I don't know. I wanna walk in. Yeah. It's like a the glorious bastards where it was underground. Remember when they say underground bars? This is <laughs> true. True to that. This was once a dungeon jail in 1792, and aside from tables and chairs, it looks exactly as it did. to Gamasan without feeling like you're in a fairy tale. Many places in Gamasan have small bathrooms because in the 1300s bathrooms weren't indoors. That's 700 years ago. It's 
by I've got my son. We're basically in Diagon Alley, <laughs> which is my dream. Everywhere you turn, I just want to film it, but I know like... <laughs> it's just like a regular alley, but it's yeah. beautiful. Oh my god, that is a line. Oh, we will. In like 10 minutes, oh. there would be a, the big change of the garden. Oh, Could cool. be fun to watch. Let's okay. watch it, yeah. had plenty of beautiful things. Chandeliers, big halls, gold, artwork, and a lot of history and walking. Part of the castle burnt down and they rebuilt it as more of a modern palace than a castle. I told you, they live here still. Yeah, they do. You can't visit one side of the castle because they live there. Palace. Assassin's Creed. <laughs> They're looking out for him. Sometimes we would accidentally get off the train at the wrong stop, but stumbled upon some cool things. We actually came across this really popular outdoor mall in Hortorget, the Mall of Scandinavia, which is where I bought this jacket. Spring has sprung. Just kidding. What? Much needed because we plan to walk along the docks and the rest of the trip would be much more enjoyable. We decided to stop for some hot drinks at a greenhouse themed bar. Isn't this stuff like the best hot? alcoholic beverage you've ever had in your life. It's really good. Apple cinnamon with liquor. Here we go. Since Stockholm is a series of islands, you're always guaranteed an insanely beautiful view. Thank you so much for watching the video. Keep an eye out for part two that's coming your way or if it's already out, right up there in that top corner. If you enjoyed this video, please make sure that you drop a like and I hope that you did because I worked really hard. If you are brand new to the channel, please make sure that you subscribe and hit that notification bell so that you don't miss a post. And welcome, welcome to the castle. Make sure that you leave a comment below and tell me what your favorite part of the video was. If you have been to Sweden, if you wanna to go to Sweden or if you've had Swedish meatballs, they're quite delicious. A very heartfelt shout out goes to my lovely patrons over on Patreon. Thank you so much for helping to keep this channel alive. I wouldn't be able to be posting as much as I can without you guys. So thank you so much for your continued support. Love you. I'll see you in the next one. Bye.